Hi everyone, welcome to an SMB Solutions Cloud Services tutorial video. Today, what I'm going to show you is how to set up your WebDAV navigation folder. So the purpose of this folder is so that you can have access on your local computer to cloud hosted files and vice versa. You can upload files to the cloud from your local computer. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to first show you how to set it up and then I'll show you an example of what I mean. So you'll see in front of you here, I have my file explorer open. I'm just going to go over here to the left hand side uh, menu bar. I'm going to right click on network and click Na map network drive. Now I'm just going to go straight down to this option here that says connect to a website and it's going to bring up this network location wizard. So I'm going to go ahead and click next and yes we want to choose a custom network location and next. Now this will be the address that you type in. The only part that will be different will be the part at the end which will be relevant to your database. So the address that we're using is https colon slash slash webdav dot smb solutions dot com dot au forward slash your database name. So for today, we're using the SMB test HANA base. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and click next. Now it's just going to ask me to type in a name for this network location. Um, so for today, I'm just going to call it SMB test HANA. And next. Now normally we'll ask you to actually uh, enter in your credentials. So that would just be your normal SMB Solutions SAP login. So that's your SMB Solutions backslash your username which starts with a U followed by your regular password. Now I'm not going to open this network because I'm going to show you where it actually appears in our file explorer. I'm just going to go ahead and click finish here. That's all done. So I'm going to exit out of this box here. And if we go back to our file explorer to the this PC option, you'll now see I have this folder available, my SMB test HANA folder. Now the main folder that you're going to be interested in on this one is the attachments folder. As you can see here, I've already got a couple of sales orders that have been saved from my SAP cloud into this attachments folder now on my local computer. So I'm going to show you an example of what happens when we upload a file from my computer and how it appears on your SAP. So I'm just going to minimize this down. I'm just going to click and drag this picture one over here. So it's in my folder. Perfect. And I'm going to go ahead and open my SAP business one. So I've already logged in via the web client. I'm just going to go and open a new sales order. And over here, I'm going to go to this little attachments option on the side. So I'm going to go and click browse. And as you can see here, it's brought up that web dev, that attachments folder. And you can see that that picture one has already appeared. So it is literally instantaneous, which is great. So I'm just going to click that because I want to attach this to this particular sales order. And you can see here that that attachment is now in there. So it's really handy because it's nice and quick, uh, it's instantaneous, and you can do the same thing as you've seen with our previous sales orders. If you save your sales orders to the attachments folder, uh, you'll be able to access that from your local computer. Okay, so I hope this video has been helpful. Of course, if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to the SMB Solutions support team. Otherwise, you can head on over to our YouTube or Wistia channel uh, for more tutorials and information, or you can head on over to our website for some more information and resources as well. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Have a great day. Thank you.